You open this file on your computer, go to the Page Sorter tab, and then go to the Title page. Now it's important to do this in order. So once you're on the Title page, go to the Response tab, then click the Properties tab, and down here, allow all students to answer all questions at their own pace. The other option is the currently displayed page. But if they're using a paper copy, you want them to be able to answer at their own pace. And then a little further down, show results to all students. Now I usually select after all questions are answered. You also have these other options. I never do after each question because then you get a lot of yes. And that drives me crazy. Then you go up and click start this assessment now. You'll have to select a class. So I don't have a class set up here. I only have anonymous mode, but you would select, say, your math class where you've already imported your students. And there's a video for creating those in teacher tools. In the setup tool, which there's also a video for, set up to use the Smart Response VE, you'll see this. If you only have clickers, you won't see this. But this is the assessment ID. This is what students will enter at the website response.smarttech.com. You click OK. And notice also up here, you can get it again by clicking on it if a student needs to see it again. Now when the students are taking tests, you can preview the results for each page. So on question number one, the results preview, you can see how many students have answered with each letter. You can also see who you're still waiting for. Now obviously you wouldn't have this up on the board. You'd be at the computer looking at this. And you get the same information for each question. Now when all students are finished, or at the end of a period, you have to then stop the assessment. That's when all of the data is collected and sent to the teacher tools. You see there it's collecting the results, and it will show up in the teacher tools with the name of the assessment that you gave it from the title page. So this would show up as Chapter 2 Math Test. So that's how to create an answer sheet with Smart Response and run the assessment with the students in Notebook.